Hello everyone, welcome back to Rehana's Cuisines. Today we're going to be doing a quick video on jackfruit. And for all of you that have not tried jackfruit, you are missing a lot. It is an amazing, amazing fruit. This is what an inside of a jackfruit looks like. And I know I have a can here, but I want to um, let you know that there is a fresh version of it available in your Asian store. Um, and if you can't find it, you can find the the canned one. If you can't find fresh, at least try the um, canned. It's it's amazing. It's got such a sweet uh, flavor to it. It's just a beautiful, beautiful flavor. I remember growing up, and these used to grow on um, on trees. And these fruit can get between twenty to fifty pounds. They're they're big. They're huge. And you know, I remember whenever we were going under the trees, you'd get so scared that you don't want one to fall on your head because they actually grow and once they get really ripe, they will fall on the ground. So um, I'll open this fresh one. I just wanted to let you know that I found this in Minnesota uh, for $2.29 a pound, which is really expensive. If you, um, I think if you're in Florida, um, Las Vegas, or anywhere else that's really warm, you could get this fruit but about for about 99 cents a pound. Then you could afford to get the whole fruit. Um, and so, basically, I want you to get a close-up on the skin. Yeah, uh, this is what the skin looks like. This has gone more brown. It should be more dark green. So, um, this is what the, it's like a spiky. And then this is what the inside of it looks like. And these are the little seeds in there. Now these seeds, um, some people actually boil them or fry them and they eat them. So, and I've never really tried it myself, but the seeds are edible. So, um, and then once, if you get the whole big fruit and you cut it in half, you're going to get this core in the middle. And so we're going to, you know, you just want to have your knife in a little bit of a slant here. I'm going to put it down. Okay, And I, I don't want to cut too deep because if you can see here, the fruit is just under the core and I don't want to lose any of the fruit. Okay. Trying to get this. It's just a, such an amazing, amazing fruit. So these are just the normal fibers in there. We're going to try and get across here. Okay, all right. So we have some fruit here and just the way this was cut um, initially. And then I just want to show you, um, let's get one of, one of them out. So see how that looks and there's no seed on the other one. Then you also want to take this little thing out. You, it's edible, but it doesn't taste so good. Okay, so you just want to take that out. And I haven't had fresh one in a very, very long time. I mean, I usually have the canned stuff. so. It's so so delicious it brings back so many great memories okay so oh my gosh now um so they're gonna have these little things in there which again like they're edible but you don't want to eat them so you just want to toss these out and then you know take out the fruit and reserve the fruit so I'm just gonna show you one more that we're gonna toss and then so see here's the our seed we're going to take that out and we're going to take that out okay see how we're going to take all that out and you're going to know when you start peeling it you'll know you know the between the really nice soft skin and this skin you'll know and in fact i've got one right there i'm just going to take out all right now i'm going to take this out for just a second because i want to show you what the canned stuff looks like this one comes in syrup and that's how it comes and it's really, really um, nice. I mean, really, there is not much difference between the... In fact, I think that the canned one each is much softer. And again, it's really, really delicious. A um, couple things on how you can pick the ripe jackfruit. It has to be um, more into an um, orange color. 
if it's yellow it's not very sweet the orange the or more orange the flesh is the sweeter it's gonna be you can also get some jackfruits that have more fiber in it they're more fibrous when you eat them so but these are great in salads they're great in sorbets popsicles and milkshakes they're just amazing they're wonderful so I just wanted to introduce you to a fruit that I have grown up with hopefully you guys can give this fruit a try and please comment on the comment section on um, if you've ever had jackfruit before or if it's your first time having it how you like your um, jackfruit so thank you for joining me on this episode of Rihanna's Cuisines hope you can join me here next time with another great video see you then friends